Hey there, Chad Boninger here for Ohio University Libraries. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use a database called Passport to find brand share and market share and company shares for ice cream companies and ice cream brands across the globe, across the countries, whatever you're looking for. Please note that Passport is a subscription database, so if you're not affiliated with my school, Ohio University, you want to check with your local library for access. All right, let's get started. So when we first get to Passport, what we're going to do is go up and click on Industries here. Now we're going to go to food and nutrition. Now originally I thought, you know, ice cream is a dairy product, so it should be underneath the dairy heading, but actually for some reason Passport puts it under the snacks location, which is kind of bizarre, but that's what they did. Once you get to the snacks page, we're going to scroll down and I'm interested to start with is the statistics. You can also follow the same patterns of research here to find analysis for the ice cream industry as well. But this video is going to show you just how to find statistics, specifically brand share of particular brands across the world. So we're going to select our product category and we'll choose ice cream here. And we can choose our geography here. You can see how many different countries are available. If you wanted to choose an individual country, including the United States, you can. For my example, I'm just going to choose world. And then under statistics here, I'm interested in brand shares. I want to know which brands are the top brands across the planet in the ice cream uh, arena. Once we're satisfied there, we can click go. And then here we see a list of uh, brands and the retail value uh, historically across time. You can kind of see uh, the past you know, five years or so. You can go up here and change this to to look further in the past if you like. Uh, you can also, if you want to go back and change countries, you can go back and click modify search and change it to a specific country if you want. Uh, this data can be downloaded into Excel. Uh, you, can, you can use that information that way. So a great way to kind of identify uh, ice cream brands across the globe as well as the parent companies. That's one thing to note here is that most of these brands are going to be uh, owned by parent companies, or they're going to be, and, and in, in most cases as well, a lot of the ice cream companies are actually subsidiaries of some of these larger companies like Nestle and like Unilever. So that's how you find this information in Passport, which is a great way to find information uh, to help you get started with your research. Back on the Snacks homepage here, we can see the Explore Analysis section, and this works very similar to what I just did to find the statistics. Now, what I tend to look for is I tend to look for the country reports. Uh, you can also look for company profiles in the, in the industry as well, things like that. But I typically start with the country reports. And right now we're looking at ice cream. And you can choose your countries here. For my example, I just chose USA. And then once again, click Go. And this will actually give you uh, some of the data that we found in the previous uh, example uh, in the context of uh, some analysis. So you do get some textual analysis to go along with uh, some of the, the similar kind of uh, company share, brand share information, things like that. So it's a great way to kind of balance the, the, the broader statistics as well. So whether you're looking at statistics or you're looking at this more in-depth analysis, Passport is a great tool to look at when you're researching the ice cream industry. Hopefully this video helped you understand how to use Passport to find information about ice cream companies across the planet. If you need more help, check out some of my guides, which can give you some assistance in your future research needs. Take care and best of luck with your research.